And from the bottom over there, you know, kind of skinnier boards on the bottom comes over, stay skinny all the way down to the end over there. And if you can't tell the uh, cabin look we're going for, something's wrong with you. Yeah. Good morning, guys. Uh, it's, I don't know, we woke up this morning. I don't know what time it is, but it was thundering. I don't know if you'll be able to hear it. There's a chance of rain. The tent is up on the uh, porch up there, so not a big deal. But we're gonna go ahead and try to uh, just go on with our day. Hopefully it doesn't rain too much. And uh, I think we'll be fine, hopefully. If it does rain, it'll be uh, Melissa's first experience out here with rain. She'll get to uh, enjoy it just as much as I did. So yeah, we're gonna see how this plays out. Oh, it is just <laughs> raining now. Um, I didn't think we'd get any. You can hear it on the roof. Uh, I'm gonna see real quick how good this roof is, if there's any leaks, yep. how the water runs off, all that stuff. So far it's already running off a little bit, but uh, we got the tent moved under, we got a dog in the car, dogs <laughs> under the house, we got them everywhere. So we're gonna kinda uh, ride this out for a minute and then uh, I guess kinda see how long it rains. Yeah, brainstorm what we can accomplish today and make it happen. Yep. Might be the sexiest thing I've ever seen. This Bacon's becoming a staple for us out here. Yes, well, you, it looks like you're going to be cooking some more BLTs. More BLTs seems to be a hot favorite between both of us. Yep. Easy, quick. The dogs don't mind the smell or the extra grease that gets poured on the rocks afterwards. Yep. Learned that last uh -uh, night. Pots. Come on now. So yeah, we're going to uh, do this, but I'm going to show you something that we just got while she's cooking that up. I'm excited. I've needed this for a good long time. A front door guys we have a front door so while that's starting to go um, when she take a break we're gonna try to get this door put it over there frame it up eat keep going but it's about time I got a front door on this house and uh, keep the dogs out I'll go backwards All right, guys, so we just got the door up, and uh, as you can tell, we messed up. There's a gap. 
We built it way too big. I'm blaming that on Melissa. We knew that. She, she wasn't even here. <laughs> Blame it on her. But no, we actually went with a different door um, than I was going to, so I got to fill this gap in. And I guess we'll talk about that real quick. I'll get down there since she's cooking. We'll kind of discuss why we went with this door and all that stuff. So we'll talk about that and then we'll frame it up. So uh, she just cooked up a batch and she said one or two. Yep. Okay, let's get two. Let's get two sandwiches today. So poured out the grease, got the bread going, toasted it up. We got enough bacon for at least one and we can enjoy one while we work on two. That's right, because we got a lot of work to do today. Uh, we gotta get this door in for sure. Maybe even put some cedar around it, that'd be awesome. And then uh, we bought some wood for another project. We'll talk about that later. But uh, for now, I think we're gonna get this, frame up the door, all that, eat. Yeah. It's smoked out right here. Exactly. But it's, it <laughs> smells delicious. So we're gonna go ahead and eat. Dogs and then, love uh, it. Yeah. Oh, they're over here. You probably see them. They uh, just waiting on it, waiting for some stuff to fall. So we're gonna do this, get that door in, get cedar around it, and get moving. You said uh, I'm gonna just sit right in front of you. I guess so. Go. 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 No. Come on, go. Go. Sit down. Sit. Just gonna block the camera, huh? All right, guys. We just ate some BLTs. Awesome again. So uh, she's doing something right. But now we gotta fix the mistake. <laughs> Actually, it wasn't a mistake. It was not. We it, totally talked it out and planned for it. Yeah. So pretty much. We were gonna go for a bigger door here. I uh, this is a 32 inch door. I was gonna do a 36. I do know it's smaller. We're gonna have issues getting stuff in and out if it's a big couch, whatever. That's the couch is the only thing I'm even concerned about, and that's not even a big concern. So, pretty much when we stick it in there, we got a gap about four or five inches wide, and we also kind of went different on the door. I was gonna have the door swing out so it's not taking up space on the inside but we got a door that swings in. Yep, so, we went ahead and just went with what we could get. Yeah, and yeah, that was the thing. They had this, the door I wanted was gonna be solid without this, and it had the blinds inside. That was over 500 bucks. Got this door for two, 299. 299, saved over $200, and then we used that money to go ahead and buy lumber for our next project we'll do later. But for now, we gotta get this door on there. to my end yeah so that this is flushed on the inside with this yep that's pretty good now just go hit the door going that way because there's about this much gap <laughs> to go that way yeah now smack this corner towards me just a little yeah one more yeah get it out there and we're gonna shim and shim mm -hmm. and make it sure it's that way and then uh same thing on this side
took two people at a time doing it because it was oh. it's a big butt. This tool is 60 bucks. Wow. Well worth it when you got to do this for an entire thing. Yeah. And then have to do stuff like that. This little tool, 60 bucks. I bought two of them actually. I'm going to get one of the Sawyers for helping me do everything. Since uh, you guys know they got a bunch of cedar. As you guys know before, it took two people forever to do that. Now with this tool, easy. Well worth 60 bucks. And I'm going to go through and collect some of these shavings while you get the next piece. Firewood. Yes. Or fire starter at least. I know the Sawyers are watching right now and thinking, oh, heck yeah. They busted butt last time doing this little. Can I only imagine? Thank you. 
cut that thicker side off. What are we doing? Those can't go anywhere. Are we trying to keep that for the other side, the long part? Correct, because these are these two pieces, or technically three, are a little thinner. So if we had a thinner option, we need another thinner choice. Got a little knot started. Oh yeah, let the hogs eat you. Take about 15 minutes, I'll eat bones and all. Yeah. No one even know you were here. No. Nope. because nothing past here yeah. gets over eight. All right. So we need how long? 15, 16. This is 
Yeah, literally right across the whole top. No? So, I think all I need to do is just trim this right here. What where piece? The door is. Do you want to or just leave it like no, that? with the rest? it has to come out right here, trim. So, oh. hold this side. All right, guys, so as you can tell, it's hot and sweaty day. She's still over there cleaning up because she's got issues. <laughs> yeah, I'm ADD, she's OCD, so it kind of works. But uh, yeah, as you can tell over here, I think it matched up really freaking awesome on the corner there, and it went right to the top of the beam, perfect. And uh, it did very, very well. And we skipped a gap right there. We've talked about it before, but I'll go over that in a minute. And then OCD over here, <laughs> cleaning up. I have learned that um, we will never have a messy spot because she cleans right after, as you can tell. We got a door in there, which is awesome. The cedar goes there. And then we were literally two planks short. I even knew it was gonna be that, and I told her from the beginning, I said, we'll be one short, and then when I, before we even started this wall, I said, we're gonna be two. She said, no, but uh, yeah, we got all this done, so. We would have been three had you not. Yes, we would have been one, one more, but she put one up. But all right, we'll look at it a little closer, and then we'll talk about that gap, we'll talk about the door and everything else, kind of do a little recap and go over it. All right, so as you can tell a little bit closer, we do have the door in here. I think it came out pretty awesome. Have you ever uh, installed a door? Nope. Neither have I. We probably did it um, not to your standards, but it works really great. It's in there. But not to your standards. I can totally tell why my door at home was uh, a little go. off. Cause she had someone do hers. Yeah. And, I'm learning uh, a lesson now. There's a lot of things that might have been not done the first time that we're doing here. And level it out, shim it, <laughs> yeah. 
all that so yeah we got that and um we got it pretty good on the edge of course it's all gonna be trimmed out and then kind of over here as well we got all the mesh so got all that uh, i am very very excited we had a board that went from the end there all the way to here so on the entire front it's gonna look like the boards went from one side all the way other she spent a little more time than i probably would have trying to mix and match to make sure the small boards went with the small boards all the way across so very cohesive look very <laughs> very very thankful for that OCD and me. <laughs> yeah but again over here guys it matched it very well you could tell it goes all the way across and uh even from the bottom over there you know kind of skinnier boards on the bottom comes over stay skinny all the way down to the end over there so we tried to keep it as good as we could all the way across and if you can't tell the uh cabin look we're going for something's wrong with you yeah because this is uh this is it's really beautiful yeah it's really coming along and as you can tell again we got all the mesh behind there so when we put chinking in it'll work very very well and then um do you want to kind of explain what's going on here i think that's more or less your idea i think it's more me that's just gonna oh, no. <laughs> You had to clean the lid off on that one. No, it's okay. Good thing it was almost done. All right, I dropped. I dropped our drinks, but <laughs> uh, right here. Here, do you want to film me? I do. I can. I'm kind of. Never done this before. Keep me in the middle there. I can do that. It's got black edges. Don't worry about that. Okay. Just keep me in the middle. You're in the sun. All I'm right. Sunshine. <laughs> so right here, as you know. I think I talked about it before. We're gonna do neighbor dogs back, but <laughs> we're gonna do uh, rock right here. We're gonna make it look like a uh, chimney, kind of, because on the inside we're gonna have a wood-burning stove in the middle. And so right here, we're not too worried about it because I'm gonna fill it in and then we're gonna put trim around the whole thing. So all of these marks that are here, these empty gaps, don't worry about that. It's not a big deal. Uh, we're gonna put chinking and everything and then we're going to uh, frame it all up. It's gonna work great up here. It worked out very, very well. We didn't have to trim anything. It just went perfect on top, enough um, for the trim to cover and everything. So very, very happy with that. But yeah, we're gonna do uh, river rock right here, the bigger stones um, right here. And then we're gonna have logs that, so we're gonna have window trim and then we're gonna have logs probably about this wide or so that go from top to bottom to border that off where the rock's gonna be, all the rock in the middle. So it will literally look. Where'd we go? Did we die? Did it? I might have. No, okay. this thing messes up. Okay, okay you're gonna have to just get. Or actually, you can look through here. Okay, yeah. <laughs> technical difficulties yeah. <laughs> but uh yeah with with the rock here and borders and everything it'll look like it was just one log all the way across and we put that right over the top so very excited with that and uh yeah it was a lot of work put mesh cedar and installed a door you're kind of out of breath there bunch of cooking yeah i am drenched uh it's almost dark and i'm freaking worn out uh what are we eating for dinner? Corned beef hash and eggs. Ooh, corned beef hash yes. and eggs. So we're probably gonna get on that, take a little break. Um, we'll probably show some of that cooking. Of course. And uh, yeah, what do y'all guys think of our cooking so far? I know so far everyone's loving the BLTs that they've seen. I know we've made that quite frequent yeah. at this point, but uh, I think it's a good staple. Bacon's always good. Yes, so. you can't go wrong. So pretty excited with that. And um, I have a lot more planned, so don't worry. Oh, We're yeah. starting off basic right now, but that's for a few reasons, but yep. it's okay. Got a lot going on. Yeah. Um, I am very, very excited. You mind picking up that tool? I can. Again, we used this tool, and I'm very excited. It worked great. You guys saw scraping before. Um, Alex and Jacob did a lot of it, and Jared jumped in. And this thing goes like butter, just scrape it through it. So very, very excited for this. Um, again, I bought another one. We'll probably use it, and then um, I'm going to give it to uh, the Sawyers because they're going to do a lot of stuff out there. i got to get you on that, but I got yes, you. Yes, you did get me. It's a very, very big help whenever she knows how to use some of the tools so far. Yeah. Um, I mean, if I don't, I'm not willing to learn. Yeah, she used a little circular saw, the drill and everything. It's great. Uh, able to have extra hands and extra help. Give me a little breather. And safety protective wear. Yeah, just make me wear glasses. We did forget some gloves along the way. But that's we okay. We both have hands that quite. Oh, yeah, hard. we got some bloody hands today. Yeah. But that's all right, so. Blood, sweat, and tears. Yes, that's going to be going in this house. I am <laughs> dead tired. So we're going to cook, rest, okay. and maybe talk again a little bit later. Of course. Yep. Let's go. All right, so we're winding down. It's been a good day. 
And uh, Melissa's over here. Got a. Uh, what are you cooking? Corned beef hash. Corned beef hash? Who yeah, are you? I know. Um, you're right, you're right. I was right earlier, you can be right now. Yeah, but proof. It probably wasn't on video. What? I'm sorry. I did I did I have to? Oh, that's right. So I got caught telling you you were right. Yep. Promise Jason told me I was right earlier. So what do we all got going on here? Just simple breakfast for dinner. Mm -hmm. I think after all the hard work that we put in, this is going to pay off really well. Corned beef hash is going to cook up. Pup, of course, wants to get into the can. Dogs are sitting around us because they can smell it and eggs. We're going to finish on our eggs. I do not like to spend a lot of money. I don't like to spend a lot of time. I just want it to be tasty and enjoyable. So we're going to use up everything we already have in the cooler right now. So. Mm -hmm. Looks like three eggs are left, so once this is done cooking, we'll mix in some eggs, and that's it, y'all. So I'm pretty excited for this. Uh, I'm very fortunate that Melissa's been here helping me. If you guys can't tell, again, we did a lot of work today. <laughs> at least I think so. And uh, to be able to, normally, at the end of the day, I just kind of eat a cold can of soup, to be completely honest, I'm worn out. I don't know how she has the energy, but she has been up to cook and help and do stuff, so I am very, very grateful for that. And, uh, and all the tools are put away as well. Oh man, it, <laughs> she, when we were done, she literally said, sit down, I got the rest. Yep. I'm used to that. So I am uh, very fortunate. And again, just like last video, all my dogs are over here <laughs> because they think they're going to get food and where's yours? Over there in the tent. <laughs> yeah. So yes, Melissa did have the tent on there. We put yep. the tent up there. It was all good. Uh, last night, not a big deal. It even rained this morning. Yeah. And then we put the tent back over there because we had to work. And now we actually have space in the tiny house. Yeah. So, um, yeah, we're going to go ahead and eat and enjoy this. Enjoy the rest of our night. And uh, relax. Yeah. Oh, man, I'm yeah. beat. So, so beat. Well deserved. Yep. But definitely got a lot done and I'm happy. It's looking good. Sounds good, too. A little corned beef hash mixed up in our eggs because I'll leave it all on here just to stay hot. We got one pan one area to cook that's my rap name you know that one pan <laughs> huh i can't no no okay listen i thought you were dale okay we'll go ahead Bye. <laughs> dale one pan the one pan man you're a funny one. Oh, you're a funny one yes. no wonder the viewers love you i smell good it smells amazing you still have all uh five dogs around us yep over there Roof. yep Bandito, and then a good one up there. Simple, easy meal. Bandito, <laughs> no, ma'am. Hey, I said no. Kind of gave you a lot more. Yeah, I mean, <laughs> come on now, even that up. <laughs> mm. It's good. Very tasty and filling. I'm not used to eating a full meal multiple times a day. Well, hate to break it, Jay, but you can get used to it now. Uh, I'm alright that. I said, stuff like this is so simple. I have zero excuse. I love cooking. I just enjoy it. I told you I'll cook for you next time. You will. Off grid top ramen. Yeah. Hold you do that. Yeah. A little cilantro and green onions from over there in it. There you go. All right, guys, we are fighting dogs here. Yes. Not dog fighting, we're fighting dogs. And sunlight at this point. Yeah, it's dark. <laughs> we ate, tired, but it was a good day. It was a great day. A lot of work and uh, got a lot more um, stuff ready to go for the next few days. And uh, Bandit finally laid down. <laughs> but yeah, very, very thankful for your help. I can say that. Again, thank you for the opportunity to come out here and, you know, prove my hard work is paying off. Oh yeah, so. it's looking good. I'm very, very excited. Um, by the time you guys watch this video, if you're following on Instagram or Facebook or any of that, you've probably seen some progress. <laughs> and so, uh, yeah, we're very excited. The dog's kind of in the way now. <laughs> and uh, yeah, story of my life. life. So. <laughs> We're gonna go ahead and call it a night, and uh, pups are loving on each other yeah. back here. Anything else you want to tell the people? 
just uh no i'm just thanks for having me out here yeah giving me this chance because like i said it feels good yeah guys get back <laughs> They have a lot to say. They yeah, they have do. A bit more than me. I'm pretty exhausted. Yeah. Billy is full. Yeah. Now it's yeah. just uh, talk about what the plans are for the next few days and figure out the next few projects. Yeah. So guys, we'll catch you on the next one. If you haven't hit the subscribe button or notification bell, all that cool stuff. Um, if if you don't know, it costs zero dollars to subscribe. Uh, <laughs> it's not like a magazine subscription or anything like that. So it doesn't cost you anything. If uh, you're enjoying Melissa on the channel. So far, please, please, please comment down below. So far, it's been more positive comments than I've ever gotten on this channel ever since the day I started. So I appreciate you guys. I love I you guys. Introduction. Yeah, and thank you so much for uh, basically giving Melissa the Crocker welcome. Um, thank you. Yeah, very much. Truly, truly appreciate it. We have a lot more coming, a lot more work, and uh, if I've learned anything about Melissa over the last few days, is she's gonna kick my butt. She got some work ethic. Thanks. Yeah, so I really appreciate it. So yeah, we'll keep proving it to everybody and to ourselves. And yeah. she may actually whip me into shape. I might. Today was one of those. We kind of figured out we could uh, do a few extra little movements around here. So yeah, I don't even want y'all to know that yet. She found out a way to work out on the porch. I did. I'm not excited for that one. But <laughs> <laughs> anyways, uh, we'll see y'all on the next one. Appreciate you guys. Love you guys. And uh, good night. Good night.